Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's your boy Dream back with another trucking video for you guys today. And on today's video, I'm just gonna be showing you guys the process of what it's like here at the rail yard. For those of you guys that are planning on joining Intermodal or are beginning to drive Intermodal, so um I tried making this video already earlier today, but I have not had any sort of luck and it's kind of weird because i feel like whenever i try making a youtube video i have like the worst luck um for today for example i i i feel like i wasted i want to say two hours without doing anything and um right now it is 5 47 so it's almost six o'clock i clocked in at 3 30 today guys at 3 30 and I haven't even hooked up to my first trailer yet. Yes, it sounds that bad. But why have I not hooked up to my first trailer yet, right? So, like I said, I clocked in at 3.30 today. I didn't leave the yard until I want to say maybe 4 o'clock because I was making sure that it had fuel. I went inside to get the BOL. I, I got to slow down. Um, but I went to make sure everything was good ahead of time so I could do this load, right? This was the first load and um, I was looking for this trailer once I got here and I couldn't find the freaking trailer. So um, after waiting maybe 30 minutes driving around the, the location it's supposed to be at, I couldn't find it, right? So I go into the driver's assist building. I even called inventory and they both told me that it's supposed to be at lot 108. And it wasn't there. <laughs> so I go back to lot 108. I keep looking and I did not find it. So of course, after maybe 45, 50 minutes um, in total have passed, I called dispatch. I, I mean, to be fair, I have messaged them throughout the, the, the whole time being here. But after I want to say the 45th minute, maybe 50th minute, I um, they, they ended up telling me, oh, just hold on. We're going to give you another load. And that is what I'm doing now. So, um, yeah, now I got to look for my next load. I need to find it. I already did all the paperwork for it, um, like where it's going to be at and stuff like that. Now I just got to find it. Hopefully I find this one and it's not like, oh, maybe you're just a bozo that can't find a freaking trailer. No, I know what to do once I'm inside these lots. The only thing is I couldn't find it and it wasn't like I just couldn't see it. No, I looked at every freaking trailer and it wasn't there so let's see let's see if i can find this one that way <laughs> i switch up the mood and you know just you know just, just do it right you know um oh i was in the actual man that's what i get for not paying attention i, I thought that was row 10 but apparently this is row 10 so the trailer that i'm looking for should be if i learn how to drive <laughs> should be somewhere in this row don't worry guys i'm a professional <laughs> the people at loves said so okay <laughs> so let's see where is this trailer it is lot 8 row 10 240 405 let's see where it is at hopefully that was not blocking like my exit 240 i already forgot oh my god 240 405 let's see come on come on it should be in 38 so it should be right here 240 405 bingo make sure no one's blindsiding us real quick bingo and simple as that so at least we found this one right Okay, always got to leave, I want to say maybe about an inch. And you could hear it, it click. Of course, you're still going to want to do your um, your tug test and your verify that it's secured and stuff like that. But um, yeah, and it sucks because for the first trip, I went into the office to print out the BOL. But I'm not going to need that anymore. I'm going to need this. But um, 
yeah so let's do this i turned off the truck so it wouldn't be as noisy even though there's a freaking reefer somewhere around me and let's do this you know gotta look stylish <laughs> come on i uh, come on i gotta do a quick prayer yes let's go okay i gotta do that because sometimes it's not in there and you know i don't want to go to lot 11 to go look for i mean to go fax one out so let me connect everything really quick just to show you guys how it how i do it at least there you go make sure that that's secured make sure that that's secured and ready to go i already checked my tires uh, uh, you can't really see, but I know that it is secured. I'm gonna have to speed up this part of the video because this is not safe. <laughs> oh, I, I won't skip it. No edits on this video. I just want to show you guys what it is in first person here at the rail yard. Hopefully the audio is not bad because of course I'm using the GoPro's audio. That's as far as it goes. Make sure that it clicks. Damn, somebody hit that. That wasn't me. Ah, I'm not wearing my boots today. <laughs> Gotta make sure. What do you hear when you, when you hit that? I look at people hitting it and I don't even know. Oh, this is one of the things that, oh, it doesn't even have a lock, so that's kinda, so as an intermodal driver, those are things that you have to look out for. Um, obviously, I didn't do this when I was, oh my God. I had to pull forward to check the seal and stuff. But this, I'm gonna use this one for example. Right now it is locked, right? So I just unlocked it basically. So as an intermodal, you have to make sure that that is locked because that locks this right here right it hooks the chassis into the back of the trailer and it has it on four sides the two in the back two in the front man i'm really gonna have to move the trailer okay whatever so let me pull forward a bit i want to do hazmat someday but oh here it is that's in the locked position. You can see, maybe not on camera, but you can see the, the rod going through right there. Let me just pull forward really quick. Make sure that this is the paperwork. This is going to, yes. Seal number, where is it? Right there, 2941 are the last four. Come on, let me do this really quick. I don't wanna make this as long of a video or too long of a video. I'm gonna just pull forward a bit just so I can see the seal, make sure everything's good to go. Why are you honk? Why are you honking? Three forms of contact. 2941 are the seal. Last four. That wasn't me. <laughs> Gotta make sure, of course, that the trailer doesn't have any, any holes and stuff like that. The doors look good. There's a den over there, but I don't care. It wasn't me. 2941, we Gucci out here okay this one is not locked as well so we got to make sure well i mean it was locked but that little extra you know check the ah that should hurt <laughs> i'm playing so the tires are good make sure that the trailer is gucci okay all righty we we golden out here so Look at, look at the truck real quick. And that's about it, right? So that's basically the process of just hooking up to these actual trailers. You gotta make sure you got yourself some safety out here. Okay, paperwork. I already know where this location is. So let's get out of here. So I don't really know what the purpose of this video after I hooked up to the trailer is, but um, you better not hit. You better not hit. Don't you dare. <laughs> Alrighty. 
So let me know in the comments if you guys would like to see more of these style videos where it's first person, me talking without like a voiceover, just real, you know, on the moment, stuff like that. And of course, even though I'm talking to the camera, my full attention is to driving, so I'm not distracted one bit. So uh, yeah, let me know in the comment section below if you guys would like to see more of these kinds of videos. Um, and I'll see you guys next time.